over to Tom, looking for the headlock as Gomez trying to step over. Going for a body lock on Yanni. Yanni, these guys going back and forth. Gomez turning it in. He's got two. And some back points on Yanni. So as I'm sure you know, Austin Gomez just pulled off the upset of the season against three-time national champion Yanni Diakamahales. He beat him 9-3, and he ended his 75-match win streak. I'm going to be going over the main clips from the match that allowed him to pull off that upset. Let's get right into it. Yanni shoots. Gomez reattacks. This is where Yanni excels, so it's hard to take him down. And Yanni flips it over, and Gomez looking for two, but Yanni splitting up, and no score, no takedown. So that was the end of the first period. They end up going into the second period, 0-0. Zero, zero. Gomez chooses that bottom. He gets up, he's up 1-0. Yanni trying to put the pressure on him. Front headlock, a lot he can do here. Got the river now, trying to step in. Old wrestling parallel. And over the top, looking for the headlock is Gomez, trying to step over. Going for a body lock on Yanni. Yanni, these guys going back and forth. Gomez turning it in. He's got two. And some back points on Yanni. And now let's slow this clip down and see how Austin Gomez pulled it off. So he's in the seat prep position. He ends up trying to go side body lock. Yanni, knowing he's dangerous from there, ends up withering down really hard to break it. So look what Gomez ends up doing. He ends up threatening the front headlock, the cement job, cow catcher, whatever you're going to call it. So now Yanni is focused on that. This allows him to slip down back to the side body lock, go up to his feet, and take Yanni feet to back. Cow Date did the same exact thing. This at the 2022 World Championships at in the quarterfinals, he ended up pinning the guy with it. Let's look at that. Something we have rarely seen. Yanni down five nothing here. Ten seconds to go, and how he goes very quick. In a match like this, to getting that right out to stop Yanni from getting the escape point is huge. So he goes into the third period up 5 0. This is real attack number one, his second takedown of the match. Yanni shoots again and tries to duck. Another low ankle rear tap for Gomez. Ends up scoring again. And this is Gomez celebrating. This is obviously a huge win for Gomez. I'm so happy he was able to bounce back from his loss against Monero Johnson from Iowa State. As you guys, I'm sure you guys have watched that video. Happy I got to post a positive video of him. Like I said before, he's my second favorite wrestler in the NCAA right now. I wish him the best of luck at Nationals. And see you guys in the next video. Thank you for tuning in.